Okay, here we go. A quick afford a plane build update. This has been my personal nightmare for the last two weeks since I last did a video. This is the rough of the um, styrofoam cowl that I've been working on. Um, yeah, nothing short of... Um, uh, yeah, it's a lot of work. I don't want to say it's been a disaster and nightmare, but a big learning curve. So this is the foam. Of course, we've kind of roughly shaped it how I think it needs to go. And then I did some body filler in here to kind of fill in some of the voids. A couple things. Um, using this body filler, kind of a big mistake because this is hard. This is soft. And even when you board sand it, it tends to cut down and mess up my profile. So that was a, a learning curve there. Second thing I would have done different is spend more time um, putting this foam in in a in a better shape because this was an awful lot of work I mean carving and shaping and sanding and I mean tracking blue foam all over the house so anyways it's about 90 something percent there next step is this is I'm going to, I'm told I'm supposed to cover it with packaging tape here then rub it down with this releasing wax here five coats of that stuff then I bought this today mold releasing agent that goes on and then the fiberglass layup. This stuff works good. This is spray adhesive stuff. So that's spray adhesive is what I use to hold all the chunks of blue foam. If you look close, you can see all manner of, you know, this is a one inch blue foam that I've cut and shaped and done everything there. And man, my goodness, what a lot of work. This is cut off for the carburetor. Um, this is, of course, you know, the manifold area. So that's kind of what's next. One, uh, one last thing, this spray adhesive, when you spray it on the fiberglass cloth, it cuts real nice because normally you cut the stuff and it frays all over the place. So that worked pretty good cutting that. So tonight we'll be kind of laying this over. What I'm going to do is take some blue masking tape, cover up all of this. Then comes the clear packaging tape, then the wax, then the mold release, and then start the actual layup. It's going to fill in some of these voids and stuff. But man, I've spent enough time on that. This is kind of front, front profile. So it's a bit rounder than just an aluminum um, cowling kind of, I said to... To my dad, I said, yeah, it's kind of like putting lipstick on a pig, but uh, trying to pretty her up, but we'll see. So anyways, that's it. That's where we're at. Next time, we'll have hopefully a fiberglass cowl to sort of show, but that's been a lot of work. It may not look like it, but my goodness, it was a lot of work. And uh, there we are. All right, out for now.